All right, guys, here's the open range residential. It's the R398RSS four season. Has the upgraded aluminum rims, uh, electric awning. So you just press the button, opens and shuts. Uh, the jacks with the stabilizers on there. The extra stabilizer bars in front and in back. I'll show you the front ones once we get up there. Just a clean looking RV. It does need to get a wash. It has three slides, two on this side. This is gonna be the kitchen, other sides. And the bed slide right there. You got your uh, sewer hose holder outside, which is nice. But huge pass-through storage area. All right, here's all your water hookups, dump valves, your big pass-through storage. This is kind of neat too. This is up, but this uh, opens and shuts for extra storage down in there. It's pretty neat. All right, here's for your jacks. So you can control the front or back. You can control left side or right side or both if you wanted to. So to get it level makes it a lot easier. Um, on both sides, this actually can hold four propane tanks. So it has the lever you just push over and you can pull out your propane tanks. So there's one here, the regulator. The second one would go here. But you can see on the other side, there's two other tanks over there right now. Push that back in. Uh, this is also has the nice big 6500 propane generator. Two batteries, one on this side, one on that side. And then I'll show you, this is the other one. Also just slides out, which is nice. Just makes it very convenient for having to change them. Uh, you also have two on this side. Uh, also, neat thing is the TV mounts here outlet your um, antenna and then your speakers for outside entertainment and there's two speakers out here we'll go inside nice big window and this is the four season package four point leveling and stabilization system so right when you come in just really nice Give you a quick look and then we'll go into here so it has a fantastic vent fan this is the lift and lower on and off uh, this is for your awning outside your AC and heat the neat thing is it could run off propane electric um, so you don't have to burn through your propane you have the electric furnace the generator inverter all your buttons for your slides, lights. Um, also your water heater could be either electric or gas, or electric or gas, which is nice. Um, really nice big cool fridge. I actually haven't seen this before. You have your water dispenser, just tons of space inside of it, which is really cool for an RV. Just tons of storage. Very cool too, like these, you can just pull out and they slide on a track system, so makes it a little easier. Nice little storage right over here. Oh, I didn't get everything out, sorry about that. Nice big convection microwave too. I mean, look at that thing, it's pretty Mondo. You got all these preset buttons on here. Um, the other thing that's nice is this does have the upgraded countertops. Oh, let's see if it'll zoom in. Oh, it doesn't. But anyways, the Corian, you have your sinks on both sides. Just tons of storage in here. Oh, these just flip down. And then this is neat too for your trash can. I didn't empty it, but it just slides in and out. So just a lot of storage. Another very cool thing. I mean, there's a lot of great features with this, but I mean, so check out this pantry. So let's see, you got that and then look, boom, this flips over. You got even more behind it. And 
And the same with this side. I mean, you can't say that's not storage enough for you. I mean, that's a ton of storage just right there alone. Then you got your nice big deep one above. I'll pull out one below. All your original paperwork's all in there. You got the electric fireplace. Your surround sound. There's a subwoofer in here. The TV. You can see one of the speakers there. Uh, there's one over there. There. And where were the other ones? Oh yeah, right here and here. So you got that surround sound. A lot of storage. This is neat too. Oh, this is, I forget if this oh, it flips up. Pulls out for a desk. And that's a huge desk area right there, which is nice. For working from home or just want to get stuff done. Uh, pull off sleeper slofa. So another bed here. A lot of storage up above. Uh, these are different, but these are very comfortable. They're not the original. All the windows here too have the... I'll show you on just a small one. A pull down cone um, shades. Uh, this is the one chair right here that'll flip into a ladder so you can get to everything that's higher in here. You got storage underneath here. Also access panel for wires. They put actually the fuse box in here. So that there's all your breakers and that. Oh yeah, it does have the central vac built in vacuum in here. I got sidetracked. But here's a hall closet, which is neat. You don't really see this much. So this is the hose and stick for the, the central vacuum here. You just plug it in, use that. What a nice little coat closet. And then here we go back. So this is the bathroom. You can access it one of two ways. You got the porcelain toilet, the one piece shower, which is nice. Just built very nicely. The sky dome, a vent fan up here again. A uh, cool thing too is right here is the plug-in for a washer dryer. Right here's your water, your water lines and discharge right there. So you would just simply take this out. You could put a two-in-one washer and dryer or take both of them out. And then you have a stackable washer dryer. Nice little sink. More storage right there, there, there. And underneath the sink too. So tons of storage for the bathroom. You have a king size bed in here. If you wanted to, um, you get a queen to have a little bit more walk around space, but I mean, you still have a lot of space. I don't know if you can tell. Little vanity, hung TV, a dresser, uh, just a lot of storage in here. I should turn the lights on before coming in. So you can just see how big all the storage is in here. And then the big closet. Uh, there's also storage underneath the bed. Just like every RV. Just lifts up and boom, all your extra sheets, blankets, whatever may have. Show you the bathroom from this side. And also too, this is also the carrier AC, so it's electric heat um, and AC. So you don't have to use your furnace, which is propane, which is just a nice little feature to be able to use electric, uh, electric um, heat. I don't know why that took me. And then you have this little, I forget what they call these. They were big and they're not anymore, but it's still very cool. You can hang your pots and pans from it. So yeah, there she is.